the president of the Chartered Institute of Bankers of Nigeria, Ken Okbara, has emphasized the importance of uh, strong collaboration, effective governance, structure, robust succession planning, and also uh, diversified ownership as key factors uh, for the continuity of uh, multinational family businesses. Our Prime Minister's remarks in his farewell speech as he stepped down from his position as chairman of the Institute's uh, Council, as he also highlighted the significance of innovation across all business functions in an evolving global landscape. Details in this report. <laughs> The atmosphere here exudes a sense of warmth and festivity. Distinguished council members, former president, esteemed fellows of the Chartered Institute of Bankers of Nigeria, along with bank chief executives, as well as captains of industries, are well represented as Ken Okbala concludes his two year tenure. Say, Ken, we are proud of you. One by one, accolades pour in as they praise the outgoing president for the remarkable transformation and groundbreaking advancement witnessed in the banking profession. They affirm that the CIBN has significantly improved on Dr. Bagas' leadership. His soon-to-be successor shares insight on what is to come. The governor assured that he will complete and commission the remaining critical projects of his predecessor added that he would be doing additional legacy projects during his own tenure. I'm happy to note that Dr. O'Hara has substantially and admirably kept his promises. We, the board of Pansios, worked very well with him. He was a pillar of support to us. <laughs> Particularly when we are going through very difficult time. Dr. Ken Okwara's choice of topic reflects his visionary leadership and commitment to the growth and development of the banking and finance industry and the economy at large. In today's rapidly evolving economic landscape, percent the future agenda implementation, 99%, branch development, 97%. It is now time for the presidential valedictory address, which provided platform to share personal thoughts on burning national issues in the economy. Dr. Okbara is concerned about the failure of transgenerational businesses in Nigeria and focuses his presentation on sustainability model. You need partnership, you need collaboration. Governance structure is very strong. Without it, people perish. Given the crucial role of family businesses in the nation's economy, the transfer of wealth from one generation to the next needs to be addressed. So it is not a flight by night thing. It's about ensuring that you build structure that will outlive you. And how do you build structure that outlive you? You make sure that you put corporate governance in place, you make sure that you innovate. If you fail to innovate, you die. His leadership has seen so many milestones of progress, and we are very happy for him, for the industry, and for our nation. We look forward to people like this. He put the name Nigeria on the global map. And you can see the caliber of people that actually came out today. Uh, the handing over, you know, that Dr. Ken is a focused, well bred professional who knows his onions in this business. As fond memories are relieved, the call for a business sustainability model that makes room for growth through diversification is re echoed. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.